And although I love this place um, and the weather and, and all of those things, I'm really concerned about, about doing something that's, that's timeless, classic, if you like. I, I tend to be sort of... Uh, I, I tend to not be blinkered, but if I'm going to work in black and white, I work in black and white. And I can only think about that. If I'm going to work in colour, I can only think in, in colour. If I'm going to work in oil, I can really only think in oil, in that space. And it's, 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 um, it's, it's, it's not a good idea. I would like to be more flexible, but I, I, uh, at this stage I'm, I'm sort of locked in, programmed. It was terrific. So some emotion and warmth and love came back into my life. And it does seem to me that black and white fulfills a need within me, possibly some sort of, I don't know, some sort of, because it's more austere, so some, I, there is, I do like empty spaces and there is a certain uh, part of me that uh, really likes austerity. Um, but colour is love. So some love came back in my life and then it happened again and that crashed on the runway and then again this year, I mean, it keeps on happening. Uh, I wish they didn't end. The last one was mad. Somebody asked Beckett, um, about success, he said, success, failure, failure, failure is important. He said, if you fail, no matter, try again, fail again, fail better. Yeah. Um, so, so there's, when I said before, here I'm going to contradict myself, um, when I said before no painting is ever finished, with the black ones, where there's black only, there is a stage where you reach, and that's it. Yeah. And if you go any further, you lose the the the, uh, the luminosity, the sense of darkness and lightness in the work itself. And so I can only do what I'm doing here once. I, I can't come back, or I choose not to come back and correct it with a bit of white paint and fiddle with it and get it right. If it comes too easily to you, um, and this sounds like 19th century romanticism, but if there's no struggle, um, uh, then, then you end up with something that's facile, and facility is a terrible trap. I think I'm hopelessly incompetent in, in, in terms of uh, the way I work. It's most inefficient. Most inefficient. I know, it's crazy. Well, because you've come up with your own styles the whole time. Well, well exactly, exactly. But at the same time, it, it's, that's what, getting back to that thing about product, it's not about doing things efficiently. Uh, let me put it this way. Um, I think we've really uh, got a lot of things wrong about time. Um, we feel we've got to we feel we've got to use time, it, and that we shouldn't waste time. Uh, and yet, to me, painting and living through the painting is me living through the time I'm painting it, and it's not about getting to something quickly. Otherwise, it'd be like playing a record as fast as you could to get to the end of it. So it's a bit like listening to a piece of music, it unfolds. But um, a lot of people think, you know, you should just do it as quickly and as efficiently as possible and get it over with. Well, well I, no, I don't agree with that. I'm really concerned about, about doing something that's, that's timeless, classic, if you like.